Welcome back. There just might be some very strong people walking around Lenexa next weekend. They've been eating their spinach. The 30th annual Lenexa Spinach Festival is coming up on September 7th. Connie Bergren is here with us to cook up a delicious spinach spinach dish. Welcome to the show. Thank you very much. What are we making today? Well, uh, like you said, in September, it's all about spinach mm -hmm. in Lenexa. And we are making a spinach mushroom, onion, and goat cheese crepe. Oh, so everything got a lot going on. smells so great. Oh, now, where good. do we start? Well, you start with uh, caramelizing onions, mm -hmm. and since that takes 10, 15 mm -hmm. minutes, I've already got that going. I have some onions here, uh, a little bit of salt and pepper, and we're going to throw some garlic in. Okay. And as soon as that starts to smell really yummy, which it's going to do pretty quickly, mm -hmm. um, we're going to also add some thyme. And have you ever stripped thyme before? I have not. This is how it uh, grows in its natural state okay. and you just grab the do you want to try okay. that sure you just grab it and slide them down All right. right into yeah there you go perfect there we go that was do fun that like a pro yeah and I usually add about half the time um, right away with the right away with the mushrooms and save the rest for later because then you have that real fresh so what does the time um, add in terms of flavor um, it's just a, it's kind of a, a dark musky mm -hmm. uh, smell and oh my goodness, it's a wonderful depth of flavor that it adds. So, magic of TV, I have that done over here. Now what kind and, of mushrooms did you add? Uh, I used porter, the little baby bellas, but baby you, bellas, could use, okay. um, you could use button mushrooms, you could mm -hmm. even use like shiitake or anaki, whatever, whatever, whatever kind you of, like. Exactly, whatever kind of mushrooms you like, but um, most people like those little baby bellas, mm -hmm. so that's what I use today. Um, and this is what that looks like when it's finished. Okay. So again, we're going to add just a little bit of thyme. And if you notice, we've got all kinds of little things that look like we burned them. Mm -hmm. All those little yummy pieces on the bottom. So what we're going to do is we're going to throw a little sherry in there. Okay. And deglaze the pan. So we hope this is a happy sound. Yep. There is. we go. And then you just use your little spatula and get all of that little... Yummy stuff that just adds we like depth it. of flavor. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to toss in a little bit of goat cheese. Okay. And that with the, with the sherry is just going to turn mm -hmm. into this yummy, yummy, yummy sauce. Oh, wonderful. And, um, so really it only takes a couple minutes when you get to this point. And, okay. um, and you want the then, goat cheese to completely melt? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. And then um, you can either pull this off mm -hmm. and add your spinach later or you can toss your spinach and it okay. looks like that's a lot of spinach. It cooks down so quickly. It really really mm -hmm. does and um, I have already pulled these little stems off most of it. If if they're if they're big ones you you don't want that because it's, right. um, it's going to be a little stringy mm -hmm. in your in your crepe once you get it done. Okay. So you pour that in and believe it or not in just a moment or two this is going to look just like this. Oh, fantastic! And it that that spinach all melts down. Mm -hmm. And um, our main ingredient, so, we got to enjoy the spinach. Exactly. It now, is now, so how do good. you um, roll the crepe to make it look great? Like you have an example, the mm -hmm. finished dish right there. Well, um, if you want to, I can even show you how to make a crepe real quick. Um, I don't know if we have time being, for that. Let's go okay. ahead and roll it up. Sorry. Very, no, very. Good I know. Idea. We, we, we could talk about crepes all day long. And exactly. Add with some spinach. Crepes are a wonderful foil okay. for anything, for savory, mm -hmm. for sweet, and then just to gild, you just put that right here in the middle, uh -huh. and just to gild the lily a little bit, um, you put a little balsamic. Glaze oh, on it. Balsamic vinegars are all the rage right now. Mm -hmm. So put that in the middle, fold it in half, and then roll. And then you're done. And end up with this. Yeah. Oh, exactly. beautiful. Thank you so, so much for joining us and Thanks celebrating all me. things spinach. Now, the 30th annual Lenexa Spinach Festival is next Saturday, September 7th, from 9 until 4 in Sarco Par Trails Park. It's just $1 for adults to get in and kids 13 and under. Well, they're free. And don't worry, we have Connie's recipe for the mushroom and spinach crepe on our website, caseylab.tv, later on this afternoon, so you can make this at home. Thank there you, you so much for joining us. Thank you. Now, let's head into the weather center with Michael and